With us today is Mr. Chester Davis, and we're talking with you, sir, today about your National APA Go baseball tournament. For those who may not know, APA Go is the online version of APA's highly popular, historically accurate, and historically important baseball game. And I believe you were based down there in Delaware, and you're a longtime retired teacher. So, a pleasure well, to be with you, sir. Well, uh, I, uh, I am retired. I've retired four times, but I'm back subbing now, uh, kindergarten and pre-K. So that's a lot of fun. <laughs> nice, nice. There are a lot of teachers in the uh, tabletop sports hobby. Have you ever been able to uh, teach your kids over the years anything about the game? Yeah, I, I, uh, I got involved as, as a kid with, with APBA, and then I faded away. And when I... Um, moved to Laurel, Delaware, uh, to teach at Laurel uh, Middle School, we had a club day. So I brought my APBA cards in and we, the, over the kids, you know, they, they took the teams and it, and it, it, it ran fairly well. In fact, one of the guys that's in the league that I'm in now tells everybody that I was the one that got him started, hooked on it. I've been in and out with coaching. I coached girls basketball for 40 years and I've football for about 15 and and I think I've coached everything but chess ping pong and checkers more and more kids are getting involved you know I, I think it's the, the understanding um you know of rolling the dice and reading the boards and you know and once it gets that accomplished and then they're hooked yeah you know, from then on so folks uh, who may have participated in Apago tournaments in the past and there have been plenty of them the uh, uh, the Apago uh, app or or service has been out there for about a decade roughly right so right. uh you know this this is going to go the proceeds are actually going to go to someone who really experienced the brunt of ophelia down there in the carolinas so right. you really can't think of a better uh reason to participate uh with your donation or with your uh, coaching abilities here. Well, now, of course, Apago is a digital version. We're straying from the actual cards and dice model. Right. right. When did you start with Apago, and how would you advise folks to approach it if they're used to tabletop gaming? I've not, not been on Apago uh, as of until here very lately. I, we, my son and I play in a league, uh, the Vast Horse Baseball League, it's been in operation for 45 years, but we've only been in it about the last three years. Um, but um, I, I, uh, I've came up with the idea of doing this, you know, and then and I looked at, uh, you know, playing uh, 40 games a month of January, you know, um, and hooking up with a guy, you know, what date suits you, what time suits you, you know, that it was going to be difficult. And, uh, and then somebody said, well, app go, you know, and, uh, and, you know, in most of uh, the problems that you run into is the guy getting the team that he wants cards, you know what I mean? You know, finding them. I mean, I have a source um, uh, cards for you that I, I, I get, you know, from, but, um, and so I, I contacted, um, App, uh, app ago and I was worried about you know it's three dollars you buy your team okay and you know and then it says in there if you play a team that that uh, that the, the owner doesn't own you have to pay an additional three dollars mm -hmm. so I said well now wait a minute you know I'm, I'm if if I get 60 70 80 teams in there and some guy doesn't own a team, you know, you're, you're biting a bullet every time you play, but I contacted them and they got back to me right away said, Oh no, once you buy that team, you own it for the, you know, for the tournament. So whether you play 20 games or 40 games, 50 games, you're good. The idea is that the other guy must own the team you're playing. In other words, they, so you don't have to pay the extra. And, um, and they, you know, they said it's, if he buys a team for three dollars, then he's good. But my thing is, in this tournament, everybody has to own the team they're playing with. You know what I mean? And then it's clear sailing. But um, I, I've I've had two or three people contact me. Said App uh, Go is is the cheapest way to go. You know, if you're going 
Uh, now, like I said, my son and I, we play over team viewer face to face, but the, the, the hard part about the league, I wouldn't know the Canadian guys if I passed them on the street. We have about three or four Canadian guys in the league and it's always, here's my, here's my game plan, play it, send me the results. You know what I mean? Which, which is me, you know, it isn't a whole lot of fun. Yeah, we have about three or four guys on there that we really you know, enjoy playing. We have Jerry say that every time he goes wrong, he said, did I ever tell you I hate this game? <laughs> but, uh, but you know, uh, but the Apple is the Apple Go is the way you know to go. But to be honest with you, uh, I have four commitments. I have three others that say they're in, but they've not. The four commitments already have their teams, you know, and uh, the other three. I'm just hoping that once everybody's league ends up in October, the, their World Series gets over with, you know, and everything that they'll sit around a little bit in the fever, a, a, a catch, you know what I mean? And, you know, and the idea, so then I decided that January and February would be great months because, I mean, other, you're uh, uh, NBA fan, you know, what, what is there, you know what I mean? And, um, and, you know, that's what I'm hoping for. Um, I, I, again, I, I'm, I'm on the uh, APA Delphi, and I've had over 1,800 hits. So there, people are checking back, you know what I mean? In which I'm, I'm hoping that when everything settles in, you know, but I had an example for you, um, mm -hmm. Jeff. Uh, I had a guy in our league, Mark, who, oh, boom, as soon as I put it out to our league, uh, 1956 Yankees, 1956 Yankees. Well, I, I, um, I send a sheet with them, which, which I get all information on, you know, so that uh, I don't give phone numbers. I give emails because, you know, a lot of got, people don't want their number out there. You know what I mean? Now, you know, if they run into a problem, they can contact me and I can you, uh, contact the person, you know, that, hey, he's been getting up with you, you know, about playing. But um, Mark calls back, well, uh, you know, I, I, I work at home and I've got all this to do, that to do. I'm not going to be able to do it. And Steve Stein from up in Maine says, I want to get in. Can I get the 1956 Yankees? I said, you got them right now. So, yeah. so you, know, you know, so, but I mean, the biggest thing there is, you know, if, if you you, if you, and a lot of guys are taking like 2010, 2012, you know, because, but the old diehards are the 56 Yankees, you know, and the, uh, the 60 something uh, uh, Indians, you know what I mean? But I mean, why not? You're playing with, with your, your fa favorite team, you know, it, it makes it worthwhile to play. Now, I usually go to Lancaster. Uh, they have a nice tournament up there, but it's like almost $200 a night. Mm. You arrive on Friday night, okay? You, about nine o'clock in the morning, it starts, gets done five or six at night. So you end up staying another night. So that's 400 and some bucks, you know? And it's still $20 to get in, which makes it nice. But then you got to eat, you know? And I, so I sent this little little cute thing, which I thought was cute, uh, out that, um, let's see, I got it here. The guy sitting at his computer, with a drinking a drink in one hand, you know, I said, hopefully it's not a beer, but you know, uh, but you know that I love the camaraderie, but you can't afford to go but once once a summer when you're paying about five hundred bucks, you know what I mean? and uh, and that that kind of caught the eye, you know what I mean? and but like I say, I, i'm I'm hoping for the rush once now, see our league ends up uh, this week. We have two series to play and the uh, v, uh, VHBL league will be done. Once that's over with, like I say, I think our guys that play face-to-face -face will, will get in. Like I said, Jerry and now John Wilson, who is our commissioner, I'm in, he said. Yeah, I'm in. Count me in. I'll get back to you as to what team. You know what I mean? It'll be the Indians because he lives in Cleveland. But, you know, but I mean, you know, that's a, um, <clears throat> that's what I'm hoping that, you know, once everything settles in and you're looking around and, you, you know, you're not playing any games or anything, that is, the fever is going to hit. I don't really care how much I 
uh, how many I get in, I'm prepared for it. I, one of my things my dad did leave me was organizational skills. So, you know, that, that helps me. Uh, Anthony um, Stevens from uh, North Carolina. My plan was to give the money to the national uh, SPCA. I'm tired of looking at those sad videos of do dogs in the cold and, you know, and he sent back, you know, that he didn't have any re anything different. He's had pets and he just lost one. He said, like, like it, it was a child, you know, he said, but how about the people down in North and South Carolina in that area that are really being hit bad, you know, and it kind of struck home, you know, and that's why I changed the idea that the money would go toward them. Now I had a gentleman, I was going to, I thought I was going to be able to give you a name uh, and John person, it, it, uh, they, Anthony recommended let him, it would be somebody in the APBA family that he knows is really hurting that, you know, that the money could go to them. And, and Anthony had picked this guy, this gentleman out, he's elderly and he has medical problems, you know, and so I said, I like to be able to tell you, you know, and he said, well, maybe I should run it by him first, you know, rather than airing it out. And he refused, but he said, you know, he's selling his APBA cards all the years that he's got mm -hmm. to pay the medical bills. He said, give it to somebody who is more needy, you know, which I, you know, which shows a, a great person, you know, and. I mean, after looking at those homes and the flooding and, and you know, some people who are losing everything, you know, that, that, you know, and you wonder how much insurance they had or if they had any at all, you know, and so that's why I changed it over. I thought it was a great idea, you know, and Anthony is promoting it for me He's in his league and, and in other leagues. So, you know, I'm just hoping, like I say, your show, you know, you know, it, it strikes somebody's heart and say, hey, why not, you know? And uh, Anthony suggested a great idea of, of playing. Uh, you got 18 bracket. You play each, uh, the other 17 five times. And he said, how about a rollover? Play, you know, a crossover in another bracket. That gives them uh, 40 games. Plus, it makes me feel better because I've set it up so that you would have, if you played, you would have four a series in which you would start as the home team. And that's an advantage because in the five game thing, you get home first, second game and the fifth, you know what I mean? And, the, you know, the other, uh, that way everybody in this arrangement gets for, uh, you know, his home team four times. So it kind of balances out. So, you know, you're saying, well, I played four, I was a visitor four times, you know, and home three times, you know, and it, it was a disadvantage for me come the seventh game, you know, but uh, <clears throat> it was his idea to do that, you know, and I set up uh, and I send this sheet out. There's a, uh, in which I have the, their bracket there. It has the a name of the team, the, their name and their um, e email address. And then below it, I had the crossover. So you would play like if your team won, you would play team one in the other bracket. Here's the example. It's got the series, and I did say that you don't have to play the series in order. In other words, if you know you're calling the second uh, series guy and he can't play, but the third series guy is available, so you play him. You know, and 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 that way you would you know you would move along the schedule. And then I said, well, we'll play the top. We'll take the top thirty-two, but I've run tournaments for softball tournaments for um, ASA and USA and um, uh, U-Trip. So I've seen these teams that finish third. You know, we just met our, they're tied and then you go coin flip, you know, and they lose out, you know, and they pay their uh, four or five hundred dollars to get in and they lose on a coin flip. Why not everybody? It's only one more round. If I get 80 people I can play one more round and it's two out of three and the higher seed is home for games for one and three, the visitor for, for the second game. And uh, I thought that would be more of an interest, you know, about somebody of getting in uh, rather than just playing your 40 games and you're out. You know what I mean? You, you could have a couple of bad series and still be in a situation where you have great pitching. 
Now, I have, I guess, I've, after I sat back and looked at it, I may have uh, squashed it because you need five starters in the in the opening series, you know, and um, so you will have to be selective when you select your team. You want to make sure you got at least five starters. You know what I mean? And <clears throat> some of the early rounds they say uh, have only twenty man rosters, and now we're up to twenty six. You know, which uh, you know, so you pick a great team and you've got three studs. And two Ds, you know, you're going to want to use your stud over, you know. <clears throat> and, a, and a lot of guys are hyper about, don't, you can't change your rotation. You can't change your rotation. But in talking to a couple of guys that, that, that did join you, they said, you know, once your series is over, you can rearrange your rotation. I mean, right. you're going to want to match your match, your best guy against my best guy, you know what I mean? Or if you're figuring on taking – Two out of three, you're going to put your three less against his three uh, uh, pitchers. And I've been getting a lot of suggestions, but like I say, I'm just not getting the rush in to, you know, to uh, sign up for it yet. You mentioned the number. You're looking for a uh, maximum of 80 participants and uh, obviously the generosity of this uh, hobby in this community knows no bounds. I had a guy who says, hey, APBA go is not my thing. But if the tournament goes on, I'll donate twenty dollars. So you know, I mean, yeah. And uh, it, the APBA <clears throat> is a big community. And I got on the internet, and I mean, I leagues upon leagues upon leagues of you know that are using the face to face, you know. And I've I've sent emails out to their commissioners, and they've been great. I sent one out for the Midwest League, and I bet it wasn't twenty minutes before he sat back. He said, "Done." You know, done. Because I think once they they read, like you say, where it's going to. One guy just say, "Huh? You're charging twenty dollars for eighty teams. That's a whole lot of profit for you, isn't it?" And you know, I said, "Well, you know, I'm not getting the money." You know, I said, "In the end, in the end, I may end up buying the little plaques." You know, and that what I did do is each bracket winner will get a five by seven plaque with a picture of Ortiz, right? You know, and to say at the bottom, you know, our league and uh, 2023, and then the four winners will get bigger plaques. And the reason I sent out the, the sheet uh, with all of the information is I told him, I got to know where to send the plaques to. You know what I mean? And in this and this way, I, I just thumb through and find the guy, you know, and I can package it up, ship it out. From your perspective, uh, even though you've come to Apago fairly recently, how do you find it as a, a player, you know, managing, talking about changing rotations and jumping from series to series and things like that? How do you find the service overall? Like I say, I've not, I've not really dealt into it uh, uh, deep, but I'm getting all these guys that are in Apago, like, well, like Anthony. Anthony said he runs tournaments on Apago. You know, uh, and in fact, uh, I I got in or we got into the VHBL league because uh, of um, a, a gentleman who, you know, who's re recommended it. You know, he said, you know, get into it. Make sure you, you know, you under that everybody knows the upfront, the cost. So, you know, actually you're saying the cost in this tournament is $23. $20 plus, the, you know, they, uh, they uh, are buying the team. Uh, the only thing I've heard, and I and I I need it, my son and I we're going to tangle in there, uh, is that they say it's a little slower than the regular computer game. But the one thing I like is they have the player's card on the left, and like the dice roll, you see the dice number on the top, and then of course it tells you what happened. You know, I think that's neat because the guys I play with. Do I want the steal where they'll pick off and they'll go to the guy? And no, nah, he was uh, he stuck only stole two bases, you know, all last year. And then they come back, you know. But you've got that information, you know, on the card. You know whether or not he's capable of of, of doing what you want him to do. I would be satisfied with forty, you know, forty five. Well, I'll I'll make it do, you know. I'll rearrange the schedule and do whatever has to be done. But I, you know, again, I looked at those pictures of the water you know, uh, in, in the homes and, and, and what, up to the uh, door of the car and whatnot, you know, 
Now I live in Laurel. We live in in a development. We have we're the highest point of elevation in our development. So uh, my, you know that that we don't get that here. <clears throat> and and I just you know what would I do? You know I mean and you know you say well you got insurance, but you know it's like a fire. Everything burns up. You don't get back the memories and stuff that the pictures and and things that you know the memorabilia that you collected. But, and and you know and these people get this wiped clean and in most cases they do tell you you know we didn't have any insurance you know we've got we, we've got nothing and we've got nothing to replace it being a school teacher and you know and you know we when you and I went to school you came home mom you, mom and dad was there they she had dinner cooked and everything there now you've got uh, a mom working three uh, three jobs and. The kids are running the streets, you know, and 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 to, of course now in Delaware we get the free lunch. You can't believe the number of kids that come in that elementary school. They grab the free the free breakfast. And my wife was uh, she retired. She was a cafeteria manager, and she said, you know, to look at those kids come through the line, knowing that this was probably the best meal they were going to get. So you know, became, uh, like I say, I'm just hoping that you know <clears throat> it it to me. You know, I'm, we'll make go with whatever comes because um, I'll I'll send the money down to John. That's what Anthony suggested, and let John disperse it. I mean, you know, if we if we ain't get eighty, then we probably should clear about uh, uh, what a uh, sixteen, you know, over a thousand dollars. Because if I have to, like I say, if I have to buy the little plaques or whatever, then I will. You know. Um, and uh, and let all the money go. He may be able to disperse it to two families, you know, to split it up or whatnot. But uh, whatever we can do in this case, you know, we'll do. But you know, like I say, I've been involved in sports all my life, so this is up my alley. Uh, I'm just waiting for the <clears throat> the ball to get rolling, you know. And they start calling in. I want so and so, you know. I want this team. I want that team. Folks can sign up up a go and. Uh... The website, uh, well, I'll put the link in the description, um, but how do they then reach out to you? It's super dog, D-A-W-G, because we're dogs here in Delaware, okay? A super dog, 17 at hotmail.com. And if they get on, if if they'll get on, um, I'm thinking, let me see, um, if they can get on Delphi, and most of them, like I say, eight, over 1,800 hits, so it's on there, contact, you know, contact, you know, and I'll send them whatever, whatever they want, whatever they need, you know, to check it out and, and everything. And, uh, <clears throat> you know, that would be the way I don't mind. And the, the, the thing it the CD will go by wins, of course, and runs loud and then runs scored. And, um, <clears throat> on, the, on the top here, you see the, you see the schedule. Uh, it has a spot for you. Uh, and what I will do basically is I'll type their schedule in and then all they have to do is put, put on there. I won three games. You know, we gave, we gave up 14 runs and scored 19 runs. And then at the end, I added up, add them up and, and then, you know, it is seat itself. Is there an absolute cutoff date? that folks have to? I said what the 14th of December, but you know, I mean, I'd rather not go into Christmas, you know, scram around because <clears throat> the boss will have other plans, <laughs> as you well know, uh, you know, but, uh, you know, uh, like I say, the 14th, if I get somebody, you know, and it's two or three days past it, I'm not going to turn them down. It will make them fit. Now, for those who might not have played, how would you suggest they go about getting kind of their feet wet once they join the site? If they go to Apple Go. There are two little video things that you can click on. It shows you exactly how to how to put your line up in, you know, how to make a pitch and change. And I suggested in in, in the uh, Delphi, get on it and play a couple of games. And you know, I said if, if like I had a guy say, well, I'd like to get in it, but you know, I, I've never used played a computer game. And I said, well, you've got what four months. That was way back when I first put this out. You know, I mean, they've got October, November, and half of December to get on at the go and play two games. And the two games, once you buy a team, your two games are free. You get two free games. 
and then you get the feel of it because you know uh, and I did put on the bottom here having played in one league I was name I will not mention you had a couple that you know you need to get, get rid of this guy he, he doesn't know what key to punch you know where you know you know and and, uh, and so what happened was the commissioner got rid of them <laughs> but uh you know I said you know be please remember that some of these guys it's the first time the first go around so you know if they don't know how to change a picture you help them you know what I mean you know and I did say if you run into somebody who is you know very uncourteous or you know please uh, email me let me know you know and uh, and because uh, I when I started out you know I, I'm searching for keys you know, oh okay. P is for play, you know, E or P, P is for pitch and E is for enter, you know, and do you, the guy gets a single runner on first, do you want to send him to third, yes or no, you know, I would always push the wrong one and get him thrown out, but uh, <laughs> when I first started, but, but, you know, I mean, they got to get a feel for it, and, and, and once they play two or three games, they'll realize that, hey, it's just like managing your little league team, you know what I mean? You, make, you, you sub in and out when, you know, when you when you feel like you have to. And by the way, I did play APBA football years ago. I may have to get back into that. I have to convince son. he works for an electric company, Delmarva Power. And I took him to Lancaster for the last right. I let him roll a dice, you know, and whatnot. And now you know uh, pop uh, you take the regular in the players and I'll take the pitching staff and we'll keep records of how many games they play. So he's, he's hooked in now. See, it just takes it, getting a little bit under your belt and, and, and feeling comfortable, you know, and, uh, and like I say, you're going to run into, I have a gentleman in elderly fellow in Philadelphia. He, they, they finally forced him out of the league because he couldn't keep up with the game. You know, you're only allowed so many games, that the pitcher that the pitcher can pitch in or can play the player, and he would overrun it, you know, and he would be playing and he wouldn't know which key, and, and some of the guys had no patience at all, you know, and so he finally just got, he got out of the league, you know. I feel he calls me about once a week, you know, and and, and talks, but uh, we just we need to be patient, help the other guy out, you know, and uh, and show him, oh well, you have, you have to do this, you know, uh, click. Put your arrow, or your arrow on this guy and drag him over, you know, and then and, and click, click a second time and it's good, you know. And that's all it takes. But, you know, uh, like I say, a couple of uh, father and son to play them was bitter. You better not make any mistakes. <laughs> oh, it was, it, it was rough. I'm telling you, it was rough. Yeah, I can get a little uh, dicey, if you will, in the uh, competition. Chester Davis, thank you so much. Let's get Chester up to at least 40. Let's get all to those 80 managers in the uh, National Chicago Tournament here, January and February. Thank you so much for what you're doing. It's really fantastic. And I hope it's one of the most important here. Well, I I think with your putting the word out too will be a big help, you know, uh, because um, like like I say, you know. They look at it, and I, I, when you when you get eighteen hits, you know you got to think that they're coming back a second time and a third time. You know that they're trying to make a decision, and uh, and like I say, they, you know, uh, it, I've got it all set. Text me or email me. Tell me, you know, I want such and such a team, and it's yours, you know, and and then you get on APBA go and buy it, you know, and then you're you're, you're ready to go. That's it. It's that simple, folks. Get involved. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it.